Yo, what is going on, everyone? It is your boy X Big Chris X here. Uh, today I have some Black Ops 2 gameplay for you guys, of course. But this is special. This is my first like free for all ever, <laughs> like ever, ever. Um, I know I played the free for all I think once in COD 4, and I think that was my last attempt, aside from what you're seeing right now. Um, what made me want to do it, uh, I was looking through, um, the, the fucking emblem shit and how you can, like, unlock stuff, and I was just looking through and I saw you need to get ten kills without dying, uh, to get, you know, one of the emblem pieces, which I didn't do in this gameplay, um, but, you know, whatever. So, uh, enough about that gameplay. Um... What I want to talk about is two things. One, the Peacekeeper, which you're seeing right now. And two, um, what I'm kind of working on at the moment. Uh, so first off, I uh, the Peacekeeper. Yeah, let's start with the Peacekeeper. Peacekeeper, um, I, my initial review was that it was an amazing gun. And that you had to use it and stuff like that. Uh, you know, I didn't exactly say that, but I said it was a really good gun. After playing with it for quite a bit more now, I think I'm um, nearing my Prestige 2 for the gun. Um, I have a completely <laughs> different opinion. Uh, this gun is perfect, except it has one flaw, and it's a major flaw. And that will have to be its recoil. It is just fucking bananas and coconuts. It is ridiculous. Um, y you know, you can barely fucking control this thing. Now, right here, I'm not using the foregrip, as you can see, uh, on the bottom right. But still, it is not something, um, that's, there's no difference, really. There's a slight, like, maybe a slight, slight difference, but overall, it just doesn't feel any different at all. So, you know, putting on the foregrip is just a waste of an attachment to me, personally. Uh, now, the Peacekeeper overall, it's an, it's a nice looking gun, and it's, um, it's, you know, the first weapon that's been newly integrated into any COD game, you know, this is the first game to, this is the first Call of Duty to ever get guns in your DLC, and for a first try, they did pretty well, if they fixed the recoil, if they just, like, Man, fix that recoil even slightly, it would be fucking phenomenal. So, you know, that's what I have to say about that. Uh, now, video's kind of short, so I'm going to speed through the last two minutes telling you what I'm doing right now. Uh, so it's kind of like a channel update and stuff like that. Uh, I'm working on a montage right now. Two of them, to be exact. One is Battlefield and one is Call of Duty. Now I know you guys. Some of you guys are split like right down the middle. They don't. You don't like COD and you don't like Battlefield 3 or you know whatever whatever it may be. However you split it, um, Battlefield 3 uh, montage I talk about in another video that was probably up earlier today. So go check that one out. Um, just look at my recent files and you can hear more about that one. Now as for my Call of Duty montage. It is a C4 montage. Uh, I kind of been getting some really, really nice kills with C4 and the Peacekeeper mixed and other stuff. And I thought I would make a little, you know, montage out of it. Nothing too serious. Maybe two, two and a half minutes the most. Um, but you know, some nice little feeds with paired with uh, C4 usage. And uh, finally got that. Been trying to get that for so long. Uh, yeah, you know, some nice, some nice uses, you know, it, it'll be pretty nice, it won't be anything spectacular, but hopefully it'll be something that catches your eye and something that you guys, uh, will enjoy. Um, as far as, like, a serious montage, you know, I haven't been sniping anymore lately, uh, I entered the sore challenge, the sore trial, and, you know, I gave it my, almost my all, but I just couldn't, couldn't really focus myself to do as, as well as I wanted to. I was going to edit it and everything myself, but, you know, you win some, you lose some, and there's people that snipe out there that are better than me, so I can't, 
you know, I don't want to say that I was the best sniper and just didn't fucking win. The truth is, is that there are people who are better than me. I really only got into sniping, seriously, uh, in Black Ops, so, you know, uh, I, I don't have the best sniping background. I mean, I sniped a little in Modern Warfare 2, stuff like that, but not as seriously as in Black Ops. Uh, so, when will you see a sniper montage from me? I don't know, but my Battlefield 1 will be a sniping montage. And it'll be a lot of headshots, believe me. Uh, so, like I said, check out that earlier video of Battlefield if you're interested in here. And you want to hear a little bit more about it. And, uh, you know, I want to thank you guys for watching. This has been your boy X, Big Chris X. Uh, I'm out of here, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Like the video. And share that shit on Twitter. <laughs> Bye, guys.